Hey guys, Thunder E here, and I'm here with the one and only, my true laptop king, Matthew Moniz. How's it going, Thank man? Thank you for having me. I appreciate it. All right. Always yeah. great to see you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. I almost sounded like the Asa CEO there. I know. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, we are talking gaming laptops, right? And you've reviewed a bunch of them. I'll and my, you. And my question, though, is simply this. Okay. What makes a good gaming laptop, and what would you like to see in your ideal gaming laptop? Oh man, ideal gaming laptop. Cooling is always the number one consideration for anyone buying a laptop. Most gaming laptops get hot quite easily, so that needs to be the first thing that's nailed, okay? Mm -hmm. Pair that with a affordable graphics card, maybe like an RTX 2060, okay. which is like best bang for your buck. Obviously a 144 hertz display. I don't think we need to go to 240 right now. Oh, wait, 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 why no 244? Well, because the problem is if you go 240, the thing is, a lot of these graphics cards can't handle over 240 frames per second, so you're not going to be able to utilize it as well as you could as a 144 hertz display. Okay, what about an OLED display then? OLED would be nice, but maybe more for content creation because you're stuck at 60 hertz. So as beautiful as it is to look at, you're not going to get that like no screen tearing gaming vibe when you're like turning corners or like shooting someone in the head. Okay, so we're, we're here at Acer. They released a couple of new laptops. Yes. My question is not necessarily the Acer laptops, but design. Are you, do you like more um, gamer-centric look, or do you like something like Razer, which is more streamlined and flat? Definitely streamlined and flat. I mean, like, you can still make a streamlined and flat laptop look like it's a gaming laptop without being like an eyesore. When you start going black and red with all these crazy colors, it's something like you're gonna get afraid of and be scared of your laptop. Like, you want something to be clean, but still spoken for. Okay, one last question. Yes. Uh, what feature would you like to see in a gaming laptop that you haven't seen at oh, all right now? Uh, you know, I'm, I'm going to be counting to okay. five. I got it right. Okay. Oh, okay. okay, I got right. it right. Never mind. Now, this is because I'm a content creator, because I want to be able to use a gaming laptop for both. I want a 4K, 144 hertz screen, so I can use a 4K screen, the extra screen real estate to do video editing on, but still have the 144 hertz to play at 1080p when I want a game. That would be like, the dream. You know that's going to be expensive. Right? Oh, it's going to be so expensive. That's you're, you might as well just kill your wallet. Okay, I lied. I lied. One more question. Okay. Um, sub one thousand dollar gaming laptops. Do you okay. recommend them? Yes or no? Yes. Yes. If you're getting into gaming, there are some great deals on sub one thousand gaming laptops. Hundred percent. Okay. All right. That is it. This is of course what the ultimate gaming laptop will be by the one and only Mr. Matthew Moniz because he knows laptops better than anyone else and you should go watch his videos they are better than mine because no, I'm true. terrible at gaming no, right no, now don't watch yeah mine. no no seriously go watch this <laughs> anyway guys I'll leave the description down below uh, definitely check him out subscribe to his channel if you haven't already and uh, also like share subscribe to the video channel not the video and always enjoy your entertainment thanks for having me on man appreciate it